Hey guys, so today I wanted to talk to you about um, something that I kind of came up on the fly. And um, is that even a term, on the fly? I don't even know what that means. It has nothing to do with flies. Anyways, I wanted to talk to you about my favorite YouTubers. And this is kind of a random, like I said, completely random video I decided to do because I was looking at the uh, YouTube made me buy it tag and I'm going to be doing that. And as I was going through, I had an idea to do for a different video. And so that's what this video is going to be about. So I'm going to tell you about my top favorite, like, YouTube, like, YouTubers or beauty gurus of all time. And why they are my favorites. Um, so the first one I have here is Michelle. Um, Michelle Fon. You guys all know who she is. She's probably one of the most famous people on YouTube. And the reason that she is one of my top favorite YouTubers of all time is for several reasons. First of all, she works her butt off at what she does. I mean, she comes from a not super wealthy, well-off background, and she made it from, like, I don't know, from... I don't even know how to describe it, but she's, like, the ultimate Cinderella story. And she is the queen of tutorials. So I have, like... A lot of them are girls on here because I follow a lot of girls on YouTube because those girls got to stick together. But so I have the queen of everything. So she is the absolute queen of tutorials. And if I ever want to know like how to do something like how to contour my nose or how to apply blush properly or how to do a Halloween look, I always go to Michelle's page because she has a ton of tutorial type stuff. So if I'm ever wondering how to do something, I go to her. Um, The next one is kind of split into two, but I like both of them. Um, just about as much as each other, and it was actually the first person I ever subscribed to on YouTube, which is Elle Fowler, um, or All That Glitters 21, and she is, if I had to pick one out of all of these, she is my absolute number one favorite YouTuber ever, like ever, 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 and she is, to me, when I first watched her very first video, like the first video I ever saw of her, I immediately thought of Legally Blonde and she just had that kind of personality and the way she talked and her name was Elle just like Elle Woods and I just thought she was the cutest thing ever and I was like oh my gosh I love this girl and to me she is the queen of high-end products. Anytime I want to know about a super great quality high-end product I always go to her page because she uses a lot of high-end products which some people don't like because some people want to know more of like a rounded kind of guru I guess and I'll, I'll get to a couple of those which I think are like that here in a minute but anytime I want to know about anything that's super high-end I always go to her page and so um, on the other side of that um, Blair Fowler her sister or Juicy Star 07 is the absolute queen of personality and if you guys are wondering what I'm doing I'm flipping through the pages because I have them written down here and when I watch Blair's channel as opposed to Elle's, like, Elle's is super, like, invigorating, I guess, if you want to put a term to it, too. But I like Blair's because she really pulls me into what she's saying. She's always so happy about what she's talking about. And she's just really into everything that she talks about. And and so that just pulls me into her um, personally. So I just, anytime I watch a video of hers, I know that I'm not going to be bored with it because I'm always going to want to know exactly what she's saying. So... Um, next all-time favorite is Vintage or Tacky, which um, her name is Cora, I believe. And um, and I've noticed a lot of YouTubers are starting to use their real names instead of just their screen names, which is kind of cool because we've known them all by their screen names for a long time now. And it'd be kind of cool to know what their actual name is. So um, if I'm wrong, I'm sorry, but I think her name is Cora. So Vintage or Tacky, she is the queen of bright, fun colors. If I am looking for something that is super out there and I want like a rainbow eye or super dramatic lips or just all out craziness, I always go to her channel because she is just fabulous and a half. So I love her to death. Um, the next one that I really like is a duo and it is um, 11th Gorgeous's channel, the two girls. And this is another one of those things where I hope that they switch over to their names because I don't remember what their names are. I know one of them is Stephanie, I think, but I can't remember what the other one's name is. I just know them by 11, 11th Gorgeous, and so, which is cool, but I'd like to know what their personal names are. And they, to me, are a very well-rounded duo. They talk about things that are, some of them are high-end, some of them are drugstore. They try out a lot of things. They're very honest about their reviews. In fact, 
I don't remember what it was, but there was a view a review they did not too long ago, and it was one of the most honest reviews I've ever seen. I was like, oh my gosh, I love you guys. And so they're, and they're just super fun to listen to. They're like so quirky, and that's what I love about them. So, um, and then the last one that I have here is J Loves Mac. Um, and I forgot her name too. I'm so bad with names. So unless I like see their their actual name like all the time, I'll forget. But she is the queen of drama. And I don't mean that in a bad way whatsoever. Like, and that's why I wrote in parentheses here, in a good way. If you have ever watched any of her videos, I have never watched one of her videos and not laughed my ass off. Like, she is so freaking funny. Like, hilarious. And she talks very realistically. Like, when I listen to her channel and I think about, like, what she's telling me, I just, I'm like, yeah, I totally think like that. Like, she dramatizes things in a way that makes, that's probably what you're thinking, but you don't vocalize it. So, I don't know if that made sense, like, whatsoever, but I just love her to death. Like, and she's very honest, and I love that completely. And there's another one that I didn't write on here, but I just thought of her, too. And, oh, yeah. Um, I'm going to add this one in real quick because I just thought of her too and she is absolutely one of my recent favorites um, and that is Miss Glamorazzi and Miss Glamorazzi I love her to death. She to me is the queen of honesty. I have never watched a single video of hers and wondered if she was like being authentic with anything whether it was talking about herself, products, reviews, like I can honestly look at her channel and watch a video that she's doing and if she does any kind of review or talks about a product I know that it is completely not biased and I just I think it was her favorites one that she just did or an empties video I think it might have been an empties video that she just did and I just watched it not too long ago and I thought to myself I was like this chick is really honest like I really enjoy watching her stuff and I really feel like she gives things a decent review without bashing it to death and that is kind of a thing that you guys have noticed throughout my videos is that I when I do reviews, I try to do them as positively as possible because I don't like when people just sit there and bash reviews like, this product sucks. Okay, well, why does it suck, you know? And she's just, I don't know, she's really good about that. So, um, yeah, so that was, that's my top favorite YouTuber. So let me guy or let me guys, let me know what you guys think. Me, yeah. I don't know what that just was, but let me know who you guys like, and hopefully you like my channel a lot, and if you have any suggestions, um, let me know, and hopefully someday I will get a better camera, but for now I am filming on my iPhone, so that's why my videos look like they do, and I don't have the best editing programs, but I try to give you as much, like, authentic, honest, like, content as possible, so I hope you guys enjoyed that. Um, don't forget to subscribe, and I will see you guys next time. Bye.